Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another episode of 4 Fishing. I am your host, Alex. Today we're going to be doing something a little different. I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Deeper Start. Um, this is their new sonar that they came out with, and it's, uh, it's you know, it's, it's going to be easier to use when you cast out, connect with your phone, what it reads and whatnot. Uh, looking at the back of the box, just some things to go over. It's got, uh, you don't have to mess with any settings, nothing like that. You just, you know, put it in the water, attach it to your smartphone, cast it out. Um, you can see right on the front there, it connects using Wi-Fi. Um, I typically, when I use this, I usually shut off my cellular data uh, just because I don't want to have people text me and I don't want it to interfere with the signals or anything and I find that, you know, you get a, a stronger connection. So, um, I also see that only weighs two ounces, well, 2.1 ounces to be exact, but I'll, I'm going to give them that. Uh, two ounces, so that's pretty nice and, uh, you know, that's, that's not going to be heavy at all casting out, so I'll be able to cast it out on a lot of my rods. I won't have to bring anything, you know, heavy or anything special out to uh, cast this, but uh, we're going to open it up and see what it looks like on the inside. So opening it up, first what you see is the start right there. Um, this is the start in of itself. That's that's the whole thing right there. Uh, it doesn't come apart. It doesn't, you know, you don't have to worry about it being waterproof or anything. It's th this is it, uh, you know, in of itself. It comes with a barrel swivel, which is pretty nice that you can uh, connect to your line and throw out. But uh, it's pretty simple. That is the charging port right there that you guys can see. Uh, the charging cable on this, I believe, is magnetic. You can kind of see it as it comes in. Let me show you guys you know, kind of how I'm doing this here. But uh, when you open it up, it uh, this is the charging cable, and um, it's magnetic. So it actually just clips on here. Pretty simple. You know that, that that's it. it. And then and then it's charging. And uh, so you know it uh, blinks to let you know it's connected. You plug it into any USB, and you're good to go. So don't have to worry about making sure it's waterproof or anything. That's, that's pretty much it. That's nice. Uh, other things inside the box. That's the holder the start was in but it looks like it comes with a quick start guide um, with pictures and things of that nature you know just just to get started on what you need to do how to charge it connecting it to the app and make sure all the connections are good casting it out and making sure that all your line is good the app and everything so that's the quick start guide but for everyone who likes to get a little bit more intricate and you know detail inclusive with their information it also comes with the actual, um, oh, that was the wrong set. With the actual, uh, <laughs> um, you know, manual and whatnot. So this gives you all the information that you would possibly need for this thing. All right, so right now I've connected the deeper start to my phone. I'm not gonna show you guys my phone screen because you'll be able to see it because I'm recording my screen. But uh, right now I'm gonna go into settings. Oh, actually, before I do that, I'm gonna uh, turn off my cellular data. So that way it doesn't interfere with any of the signal or anything, you know, out there when I'm using it. Just make that a habit right off the bat. But uh, I'm gonna run the simulation for you guys so you can see what it looks like uh, when you go out and you actually use it. From what I understand, you're not gonna have the characteristic streaks um, like you know the, the Pro or the Pro Plus would show you. Um, it's just gonna show you the fish icons, which is nice because that way you know you don't have to worry about are you looking at you know di different things or you don't have to worry about all that. You just see where the fish are, you throw it out, you catch the fish if they want to cooperate with you. That is. But uh, it shows you, you know, the bottom of the map or the bottom of the lake on the map. Uh, you know, it shows you the different contour and whatnot, and the fish icon and the sizes. The number right above the fish icons is the uh, depth at what it, at where it marks the fish. So right here, I can still see the bottom of the lake. I can still see when the depth comes up. You know, when it goes down. I can see bumps. I can see you know divots in it, uh, drop offs, cliffs, and uh, you know, as, as well as fish. So there you can see, you know, you got the drop off, it shows up, shows a little more, and then another fish. So I'm hoping that when I go out to the Hidden Lake, I'll be able to see what it looks like furthermore out there. Um, I might even do it at a couple of different lakes to kind of give you guys a contrast of what it looks like in different areas. But um, if you guys like this kind of video, let me know. And um, yeah, that's my deeper start video. I'm gonna be going out and using this. Watch out for that video. Uh, like I said, I'll probably go to the Hidden Lake, maybe a couple of other lakes, see if it can't put me on some fish. We've had a lot of problems this year in Florida in freshwater because it's been so wacky. So honestly, I haven't even been trying. If you've been following my channel, you know I've been doing saltwater. So I'm hoping this will give me the leg back into what I need to go uh, freshwater fishing. So keep an eye out for that. Until then, I'll see you guys next time.